What's going on, everybody? It's your homeboy Cable Line Network here. I'm chilling out, Max. Now, how are you doing today? Okay, guys, now in this video, we're going to discuss details about the new leveling up system for your weapons that the new DLC, Dark Below Raid for Destiny, is going to implicate. Now, it's not going to be like anything we've ever seen before. You're actually going to have to get materials to upgrade your weapons. You actually will get a weapon starting out as a uncommon, then it will move up to a legendary once you upgrade it, then it will move up to an exotic. You will basically like Pokemon Evolve. Digimon, Agumon type evolving thing going on. Yes, it's really cool. Now, I'm actually interested in that just because it's going to give a little bit more feel to your weapon. You actually be able to decide how you want to use your weapon. It'll have a lot more versatile options with it as well. By the way, I'm using the um, using the Vanguard. Yes, you know, this weapon is actually pretty good. Now, I talk F about the Vanguard, but this is actually really good. I'm not going to lie. Okay, guys. Now, I didn't get sidetracked. I apologize for that. Let's get back into this. I'm actually assuming this. I'm not 100% sure, but I think you know how the rewards that you get in the raid, it'll be the weapons, the boots. I believe that instead of some of the weapons and gear, we're going to get these materials because these materials are going to be used to, like I said, upgrade your weapon to exotic and legendary. So I don't think much is going to make it that easy to access it. I believe they're going to uh, change it up and give some of those ass rewards. Now that's going to make some people mad, but hey, it's cool because it will actually make the raid a little bit more enticing in a way. Because the last raid, truly, all you had to do was push that guy off the edge. If you played this game when it first came out, it was easy to beat the raid because it was a big exploit. You basically push Atheon off the edge. Now they fix it to where you push him off the edge, he'll be able to teleport back on. Uh, it was a lot easier to get materials. Everything was basically gravy for us. That's why I'm level 30 now. That's why now you're playing Destiny. Like, how do these guys get such high levels? Because when the game first came out, there were a lot of ways you can get this stuff a lot easier by loot cave exploits. But anyway, now back to what I was saying. The last raid, once you actually beat it, like let's say you beat it legitimately, you only needed three pieces to get the third. You could have got the helmet. Well, I'm not gonna tell you all the variety of different ways, but yeah. It's four pieces of armor. You could have got either three. You got the exotic piece, and then you didn't have to do the raid anymore because now you're level 30. You got the achievement. Now, with this one, I don't think any exotic armor piece is going to be, I believe it's um, plus 32 or plus 80 light or something like that. None of them are going to be that. So, you're going to have to get the whole set if you want to be 32. This is like a bigger challenge in the last raid. That's what this game is about bigger challenges. Now, I can't wait for this. Put in the comments, what do you think about this? It's going to be a lot harder to get the gear now in this raid because instead of giving us the gear, they're going to give us materials. Seriously, they're going to do that, guys. I'm telling you. So now it's going to be a lot harder. The randomization thing they got going, the randomization system, is going to be a lot more difficult. People are not going to be able just to come in the raid for about two weeks on three different characters. That's six times you do the raid. Now, once you beat it, then you easily get the armor then you're done not this raid this raid is going to be a lot more difficult you will not be able just to push them off the edge because in this raid everything's going to be on solid ground like i said it's going to make it a lot more interesting it's going to make it a lot more badass i can't wait for it i'll keep you guys updated every step of the way i will be live streaming it on twitch as well yes as well and i'll make sure to keep you guys updated on every single part of that on this youtube page make sure to subscribe for more okay guys this has been cable line network here have an awesome day. Thank you for watching this video. And like I said, make sure to bump this video up and favor it so you can keep updated with what I do. Yes, what I do. All right. Peace out, guys.